Hi, this is Peter from the DJ Podcast. In this video, we'll be looking at how you can use a DAW, or Digital Audio Workstation, to fix mixing mistakes from a DJ podcast or radio show episode. Let's take a listen to an example of a beat repeat effect gone wrong that will illustrate the kind of mistakes that we can fix using this technique. And that sounds pretty bad to me, so we're going to go ahead and fix this. The way that we're going to do this is by re-recording the track and then splice the two together. So you can simply go a little bit down in the timeline and then start re-recording from the beginning of that track. When you're done with the latter part of your mix, you can simply slice the two together, and that's what we'll be doing. Now, like any good cooking show, I've already gone ahead and recorded this sample again. In this scenario, I've made sure that the recordings start at the very beginning. But of course, if you're using two tracks, you'll have to go ahead and line them up yourself. It's pretty easy to line them up. You need to simply drag it onto a second track and then bring it below and make sure that the waveforms match up. You can do that by simply zooming in and making sure that everything looks like it's in place. Now that we have the two tracks, one with the good audio and one with the bad audio, we need to make sure that we splice it at the right time. So what we're going to go and do is solo this track and we're going to listen to hear when everything goes wrong. Okay, so it sounds like the first bar is good and after that things just go awry. So what we're going to do is leave the first bar of the first clip. So we'll go ahead and just get rid of the rest. And then we will get rid of the first bar in the second clip. So now we have two clips. And one starts at the end of the other. So if we unsolo this, and then we can even bring this up to the first channel. Now it should sound like one long clip or sample and the listener shouldn't be able to tell that the two were sliced together. Let's take a listen and see if we're right. If you'd like to see more videos to improve your DJ mixes, visit thedjpodcast.com.